in this video we'll see how to create a simple table in latex so um, you need to ensure that this tabular environment is there so if it is not there although it will be there by default otherwise if it is not there we have to go up here and use slash use package tabular so suppose if it is not here then we can simply um, slash use package we can simply type slash use package tabular sorry uh, tabular yes so it will automatically uh, incorporate that package with this latex file how to create a simple table so first you generally put a table in the center so you write slash begin center slash begin tabular this is where you begin your table if you have three columns you'll put a separator c separator c separator c separator so this separator is basically these lines these four lines vertical lines this h line will create your horizontal line on the top cell one and this ampersand symbol will differentiate between the columns and this double uh, slash single will differentiate the rows so i think that's clear right and this finally h line will be this bottom line here once you're done you can end the tabular and you can end your center okay um you can have multiple h lines and multiple uh, vertical lines as well so sometimes you want a table with fixed column lengths so how do you do that so uh, we just saw a table with c now we'll see a table with m so we can write m 5 em m 1 centimeter m 1 centimeter so it will have fixed length okay so the length will not change you can also have uh, a package known as tabular x which is a little more flexible package um, it is used to distribute the space inside the column evenly so you can read more about tabular x on the internet um, right now i'm only covering the important things okay so multi row is very important so first of all you will write this in the header use package multi row what it does is it will combine rows like this so multiple rows are com combined how do you do that so you simply write slash multi row if you have to combine three rows then in the bracket three in the bracket you just write like what is the column width and then the text inside that row and then finally you write the content of the first row followed by content of second row followed by content of third row make sure you have this and sign in the beginning of the second and third row because uh, this multi row is going to cover the these three rows okay uh, now this is very important because sometimes the table will be overflowing from a page what you use is called as long table this long table will ensure that your table will not be trimmed at the end of the page it will continue on the next uh, page so for that first of all i'll recommend you to visit this site overleaf.com slash learn slash latex slash tables and you can simply copy and paste and then change the content accordingly okay i think that's enough as far as a uh, table is concerned uh, we'll see in the next video how to insert figures